the ever-evolving digital landscape, social media stands as a colossal pillar, reshaping our world. Following the whirlwind of our last exploration into modern-day influences, particularly the deep dive into Andrew Tate's saga, we've seen the powerful waves influencers can create in this digital ocean. Welcome back, allies. Your overwhelming engagement with our last venture into the realm of influencers has set the stage for today's exploration. We are venturing deeper into the heart of our digital era, uncovering the essence of social media and its intricate dance with society. Our journey with Andrew Tate opened many eyes to the might of individual influence in the digital world. Today, let's broaden our lens, examining how this tool, social media, has become a cornerstone in shaping our collective consciousness. Question, is it appropriate for law enforcement to monitor social media to prevent and solve crimes? As protests continue across Iran, CNN has learned that authorities are using technology to gain access to protesters' cell phones and social media accounts. From the Arab Spring to the hashtag MeToo movement, from educational breakthroughs to political turmoils, social media has been at the heart of it all. It's a digital canvas where our dreams, fears, and aspirations come to life. As we embark on this exploration, we invite you to join us in understanding the multifaceted nature of social media. It's a journey through its triumphs and tribulations, a narrative that weaves through every aspect of our modern existence. Together, let's decipher the language of likes, shares, and emojis. Let's unravel the threads of connectivity that social media has spun around the world. Allies, this is The Digital Mirror, social media's impact on society. Our journey begins in the late 1990s. The dawn of social media and the World Wide Web as we know it today. It was a time of digital experimentation, where the seeds of connectivity were first sown. Remember Six Degrees, the first recognizable social media site? In 1997 it laid the groundwork for what was to come. Then came Friendster in 2002, pioneering the concept of Friends Network, which would become a cornerstone of later platforms. 2003 brought us MySpace. A blend of music, personal blogs, and customizable profiles. It wasn't just a platform, it was a canvas for self-expression. Close on its heels, LinkedIn established itself as the network for professionals and job search. The game changed in 2004 with the launch of Facebook. Initially a college-only network that exploded into a global phenomenon emphasizing minimalistic design choices to secure its place in the social media landscape. Thereafter, Twitter revolutionized communication with its microblogging format in 2006. But the revolution was just starting. An iPod, a phone, and an internet communicator. An iPod, a phone, as smartphones became ubiquitous, in 2010 Instagram and in 2011 Snapchat redefined social media, emphasizing visual content and instant sharing. These platforms weren't just about connecting, they were about sharing moments in real time. Each platform brought its flavor, from the short-lived but impactful Vine to the current giants like TikTok, which has redefined content creation and consumption. The landscape of social media is a tapestry of innovation, each thread representing a platform that contributed to the digital dialogue. As we progressed through the 2010s, we witnessed the diversification of social media. Platforms like Pinterest, Twitch and LinkedIn evolved catering to specific interests and communities. Blah, blah, blah. These platforms became stages for global movements, trendsetters, and even agents of political change. 
They are not just tools of communication. They are shapers of culture, mirrors of society. From humble beginnings to the complex networks we see today, social media's journey is a testament to human creativity and our inherent desire to connect. It has evolved from simple text posts to a multifaceted digital universe, reflecting every aspect of human life. In the labyrinth of likes and shares, social media shines as a beacon of positive influence. Its power extends far beyond mere connectivity. Let's start with entrepreneurship. Social media has democratized business, giving a voice and a platform to small-scale entrepreneurs and artisans. From Instagram boutiques to Facebook marketplace sellers, countless individuals have turned their passions into livelihoods. Then there's the power of advocacy. Movements like Hashtag MeToo and environmental campaigns have found a global audience thanks to the virality of social media. These platforms have given individuals a collective voice, powerful enough to challenge norms and advocate for change. Education has been revolutionized too. Knowledge is no longer confined to classrooms or expensive textbooks. Platforms like YouTube have become virtual classrooms, where one can learn anything from coding to cooking. Respectively, we urge you to subscribe to Allies of Zen to elevate your influence and power game significantly. But perhaps the most heartening aspect is the community support. Social media has enabled people from all walks of life to find their tribe. Be it support groups for mental health, parenting forums, or space for hobbyists. These platforms have fostered a sense of belonging and understanding. Social media has also been instrumental in emergency responses and disaster relief efforts. Real-time updates and global reach have made it possible to mobilize resources and support like never before. Ardeep Lachere was desperate. I needed some way to stay sane. She'd lost her job in Los Angeles home. She needed help and found it at her fingertips. It is the way people are finding housing. It is the way people are finding food banks. It is social networking, blogging, Facebooking, and tweeting. Crowdfunding campaigns have seen overwhelming success on social media, turning viewers into benefactors. From medical emergencies to educational aspirations, these platforms have brought humanity together, turning empathy into action. In a world where distances grow shorter digitally, social media has emerged as a powerful tool for good. It amplifies voices, democratizes opportunities, and nurtures communities. As much as it is a mirror to society, it is also a catalyst for positive change. The positive impacts of social media are as diverse as its users. In this vast digital ecosystem, every like, share, and comment can be a step towards a better world. Newsnight has learned that parents complained to the Department for Education about racism and bullying at Steiner schools, those schools favoured by less conventional middle-class families. However, amidst its many gifts, social media also casts long shadows. Let's delve into its darker alleys. At the forefront is the scourge of cyberbullying and misinformation. Social platforms while connecting us also serve as conduits for harassment and the rapid spread of false information, often with dire consequences. Addiction to these platforms is another growing concern. The dopamine rush from notifications and likes has led to compulsive behaviors, impacting mental health and well-being. And then there's the issue of our dwindling attention spans. The rise of short video content on platforms like TikTok, Instagram Reels, and YouTube Shorts has reshaped the way we consume information. We are increasingly craving quick, digestible content, often at the cost of our ability to focus and engage deeply. 
This constant stream of rapid content is rewiring our brains. We are becoming more prone to distractions, less patient, and often find it challenging to engage with longer, more complex tasks. The impact extends far beyond the digital realm. Real-life interactions, conversations, and relationships are feeling the strain. The art of deep, meaningful connections is being overshadowed by the allure of virtual interactions. I don't care if you want to be a disgusting prostitute, but it is kind of annoying to watch all these women post seductively pretending that they're all models. Like this has become the euphemism for a modern day prostitute. I'm a model, an Instagram model. Moreover, the influencer culture propagates unrealistic standards of beauty, success, and lifestyle leading to issues of self-esteem and dissatisfaction among users, especially the younger audience. In essence, while social media has the power to connect, it also has the potential to isolate, mislead and addict. The key lies in navigating this digital landscape with awareness and balance. As we embrace the digital age, let's not forget the value of disconnecting of looking up from our screens to the world around us, and of nurturing our minds for sustained attention and deeper understanding. Social media's reach extends into the social and political fabric of our society, weaving narratives that can unite or divide. Consider the Arab Spring again or the Black Lives Matter movement. These pivotal moments in history were fueled by social media's power to mobilize, to broadcast unheard voices and to unite people across the globe for a common cause. The peaceful transfer of power, the cornerstone of American democracy, seemed a highly abstract concept today. As Trump supporters clashed with police, as they tried and succeeded, to storm the Congress, where America's elected leaders had gathered to certify the election victory of Joe Biden. But the same tools that unite can also divide. A stark example is the storming of the US Capitol in Washington, D.C. Here, social media platforms played a critical role in organizing the riots. Former U.S. President Donald Trump's use of platforms like Twitter not only shaped his political communication, but also demonstrated how powerful these tools are in influencing public opinion and action for better or worse. Daddy, did the U.S. government ever contact you or anyone at Twitter to pressure Twitter to moderate or censor certain tweets? Yes or no? We have a program. Did the U.S. government ever contact you or anyone at Twitter to censor or moderate certain tweets, yes or no? We receive legal demands to remove content from the platform from the US government. Globally, we see governments leveraging social media for propaganda, surveillance, and controlling public narratives. The line between information and manipulation is often blurred, impacting democracy and freedom of expression. The digital public square is now a battleground of ideologies where echo chambers amplify voices but also deepen divisions. Civil discourse is often lost in the cacophony of extreme opinions and targeted disinformation. Social media is a double-edged sword, capable of both building communities and sowing discord. Its impact on the social and political landscapes is profound and continues to evolve. As digital citizens, we must navigate these waters with critical thinking and a sense of responsibility. Let's use these powerful tools to foster understanding and positive change, not division and chaos. As we step into the future, the trajectory of social media is poised for unprecedented evolution. Imagine a world where virtual reality and augmented reality blur the lines between the digital and physical realms. Social media will not just be a platform, but a universe of immersive experiences. Artificial intelligence will further personalize our social media experiences. 
AI's ability to analyze vast amounts of data means content that's more tailored to individual preferences, but also raises concerns about privacy and ethical use of data. Where we have for the first time, we will have for the first time something that is smarter than the smartest human. Um, and that, I mean, it's hard to say exactly what that moment is, but, but there will come a point where no job is needed. You can have a job if you want to have a job for sort of personal satisfaction, but the AI will be able to do everything. Creators on platforms like TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube are already harnessing AI for content creation. The future will see even more sophisticated integration, making our interactions more and more artificial and potentially more fake. Mental health is a growing focus as well. We'll see a rise in platforms and features dedicated to wellness, offering support networks and resources to promote mental and emotional well-being. Education and professional development will also see a boost from social media. Platforms will become hubs for learning, skill development and career networking, transcending traditional educational boundaries. Politically, social media will continue to be a tool for grassroots movement and campaigns. Its role in shaping public policy and governance will expand, with both challenges and opportunities to democracy. The fight against misinformation remains critical. Future platforms will need to balance freedom of expression with responsibilities to prevent the spread of false information. In the end, the future of social media lies in our hands. It's a canvas for our creativity, a tool for our empowerment, and a bridge to connect us. Let's shape it with vision and responsibility. Social media. On social media. Social media. As we reach the end of our journey through the labyrinth of social media, let's pause and reflect on its profound impact on society. From its humble beginnings to the colossal force it is today, social media has redefined how we connect, learn and engage with the world around us. It has become a digital heartbeat, pulsating with the collective rhythms of our desires, fears and aspirations. We've witnessed its power to uplift voices, to forge communities and to ignite change. Yet we've also seen the shadows it can cast, the spread of misinformation, the echo chambers, and the taller mental health. As allies of Z, we stand at the forefront of navigating this digital domain. Our mission is to harness its potential responsibly, to build bridges, not barriers, and to elevate discourse with integrity and insight. I want to extend my heartfelt gratitude for your engagement with our recent video on modern day influencers. Your thoughts, perspectives, and dialogues enrich our collective understanding. Looking ahead, the canvas of social media is vast and ever-changing. Together, let's paint it with the colors of knowledge, empathy, and innovation. Let's be the architects of a digital world that reflects the best of who we are and who we aspire to be. Before we part ways, remember to engage with us across our platforms. Follow or subscribe, like, share, and dive into the discussions. Your voice matters in shaping the narrative of all times. Stay curious, stay connected, and above all, stay in power. Until we meet again in our next exploration, be the change you want to see in the digital world.